In the previous video, I talked about the fact that fragrance notes split into top, mid and bass, and that these relate to evaporation. But why exactly do we talk about top, middle and bass, and what exactly is in each of those categories? To tell the story, we need to go back a little bit in time to 370 BCE. Theophrates wrote a book called Inquiry into Plants, and there's a small section of that book called Concerning Odours. Now, it's generally said that this is the first written categorization of smells. He split into good and evil and various other characteristics, including putrefaction, which he said wasn't a characteristic per se of, of, of smells as a primary character, but it was something which inhered in substances which could rot. So I'm now going to skip through uh, alchemy in the West, folk knowledge generally around the world, and come to written accounts in, in the 19th century. The Art of Perfumery in 1857 by Septim Pierce, I think it is, we think was the first person who used the concept of notes. He actually talked about octaves and harmony in that work. Ten years later, in 1867, Eugene Rimmel, yes, that Rimmel, uh, did a work which is Book of Perfumes, and there he came up with an 18-point classification system. Hence Vardemaker in Germany, Crocker and Henderson in America uh, next in 1927 came up with a kind of Dewey Decimal system which is fantastically detailed. But then we get to 1955 and William Pusher and it is volume 6 number 2 the Journal of Cosmetic Chemists and his paper is The Classification of Odours and Its Uses and it is this paper where top, mid and base were defined. So Pusher talks about this history, but he said that the, the problem is that all these classification systems are not really science-based, so they're not systematic enough for a working chemist to create reliable outcomes from. So we started to think about it. In 1926, the paper was published in 1955, he thought about this for... 29 years. And I intended to do all this in one three minute video, but I realised I've only got halfway through my script. Yes, I did so much research for this, I had to write a script. Um, so I'm going to do a part two. Now, I can't link things on this, this on TikTok. So on the Instagram and the YouTube version of this, <clears throat> I'll actually do links to all the original papers that I'm talking about. So if you really want to go back and read something from uh, 370 BCE, I'll link to it for you. I think I should say, like, don't don't change the channel now or something, or like and something like that. I don't 